And speaking of holiday travel, Air Force One touching down last night in Nantucket. You see President Biden and the First Lady as they arrive to continue their family tradition of spending the holiday on the island. And last week, the president talked about the improving supply chain conditions as the holiday season ramps up. Kate Walsh joining us live in Providence. And uh, this year, Kate, preparing for Thanksgiving early was the key to a successful preparation process. That's right. Even though he said everything would be in the market when people needed it, you know, people planned ahead getting those frozen turkeys week in advance to put them in the freezer just to make sure they had them. And it's kind of a similar situation here at LaSalle Bakery. They said they had pre orders two weeks in advance to make sure that they had enough supply here to make those orders that were placed. And today is the day for all of those orders to be picked up. So take a look over here. You can see lots of rolls for people to just come in without the pre order and pick them up. And then pies, pies, Pies and more pies throughout the store. Again, people can just come pick up what there is available, but I can tell you that they have had staffing shortages, the owners said, just like they're experiencing everywhere. So instead of opening at six like they have in the past, they opened at seven this morning. And, you know, we're just six minutes into the seven o'clock hour and it's already packed. Basically, a line out the door at this point. And before doors opened, that was the case, a line down the sidewalk for people waiting to get in and get those orders. We're already seeing a lot of people getting bread this morning, likely for their Thanksgiving meal tomorrow. And, you know, the big items, in addition to the rolls and pies or everything cream related, they said apple pies, pumpkin pies, banana cream, things with chocolate in them. And owner Michael Manny said they have great customers who are patient and still willing, willing to pay more this year as they've had to raise their prices based on an increase in prices they felt in the supply chain. Ordering more when we can get it so that when it does happen, we're not scrambling. Um, as you know, everything we have is perishable, so we really can't load up too much on a lot of ingredients. So we are kind of uh, flying by the seat of our pants with, with perishable, really perishable ingredients like milk and things like that. But boxes and stuff like that, we have been able to load up on. So they've been busy throughout the night. One baker told me he got here at 9 o'clock last night making all of the dough and then baking it overnight. We were here early this morning around 5 o'clock watching them take it all out of the oven. It smells so good in here still. And so they're just looking forward to a good sales day. They said this is a one-day holiday for sales where other holidays like Christmas are the whole month of December long. So they're really relying on this day of those pre-order pickups, which are from 8 to 1, and then the store is open for you to come in and get anything they have here from 7 to 6. Live in Providence, I'm Kate Walsh, 12 News.